Okay. First of all, can you tell us your full name? Peter de Neve. What's your father's name? Gilbert. What's your education? Uh, I was a law student. So, went yeah. to university and studied law. What is your profession? Uh, my profession is a uh, sales manager uh, in a company named Cosmolift. We're part of the Schindler Group, so we're installing elevators. What would you do, what kind of a job, if you had the choice, if you didn't do what you do now? That's a difficult one. I think every now and then you, you see a job you would like to do. Uh, maybe work in bike industry, I did before. Uh, maybe work with sportsmen. But I think the job I'm doing at this moment, uh, I like it very much. I know that your mother died a few years ago. Mm -hmm. What kind of a role does she play in your life of today? Mm. It's more like an everyday role. Um, because many things you do, uh, I want to tell her, I want to, uh, to share with her. Um, and she always wanted to get uh, the best out of people. I want to do the same and uh, do the best in, in whatever I'm doing. Do you know where your name comes from, the navel? Oh, actually I don't have a clue. <laughs> <laughs> do you have an idea about your family roots? Because uh, as a Belgian it's a justified question, isn't it? Uh, yeah, Belgians come from everywhere. Yeah. We had like the, the Spanish guys coming in, the, the uh, Habsburg guys coming in, the Hollanders coming in. Since when are you in triathlon? Uh, actually only two and a half years ago I started triathlon. I did cycling before but I really wanted to have new experiences and triathlon was really the thing I dreamed of for a long time. Was there a person, a role model, an incident that made you change to try to decide for triathlon? Um, I always looked up at triathletes being a cyclist. Uh, I looked at Luc van Lierde who was the famous Belgian winning uh, Ironman Hawaii for the first time. Uh, Rutger Beke who is now my teammate so that's, that's really great. If you didn't do triathlon which sport would you choose? As a little boy I liked to play soccer. Um, Probably would be would be great to be a soccer player, but I'm just not having the body for it, and maybe I'm more like I more have the spirit to be a triathlete and an endurance sportsman. Which would be the least sport you would choose? Mm -hmm. Something like golf. <laughs> <laughs> I think there's not not enough motion involved. When did you get your first bike? Uh, really like a sports bike. Now your first bike. My first bike uh, when I was five years old, something, something like that. What did this bike about, mean to you? Uh, the first thing about that bike was uh, trying to to roll on two wheels <laughs> because it had four wheels on. <laughs> uh, my, my dad had a bike with smaller tubulars on and whenever I went on it I went faster and it had like three or four gears so that was pretty impressive to me. <laughs> Which is your favorite discipline in triathlon today? Uh, today it's the bike I think. The bike is my favorite yeah. discipline because it's my best one um, and it's really the discipline I have to get most out of it because I'm a slow swimmer. What was the first thought that popped up when you heard that you had qualified for Hawaii this year. Ah, uh, yes, I finally made it! <laughs> <laughs> if you think about this race, what do you assume would be your greatest joy? Um, first of all, to finish. Uh, to finish well, coming back into Kailua Kona on the run with a good feeling. And just enjoy the atmosphere, all the pros being there, a race being followed uh, all over the world all the triathletes all over the world following this race. Uh, I think more or less that. And what is your greatest fear? Uh, my greatest fear is uh, not being able to run very well. And it's just two weeks ago Lothar Leder was talking to me and Lothar told me just try to run. 
not try to walk, and that's my mm -hmm. greatest fear. Um, what do you consider as your biggest success this year, 2010? Um, I think two races. My first Ironman, Ironman France in Nice. Uh, I went into this race very relaxed because I had my Hawaii slot already. So I just wanted to finish an Ironman just to be reassured for Hawaii. And everything went so well, everything went so smooth and was relaxed and I had quite some energy even at the finish line. So that was an, an, an amazing achievement. And the other one is two weeks ago, the, the half Ironman in Wiesbaden. I'm just building up my shape for Hawaii. And I was so amazed getting 37th at the finish line out of 3,000 athletes. I didn't expect to do that at this point of my season. What is your favorite word? My favorite word? Mm, that's difficult. Maybe challenge. What is your least favorite word? Uh, disappointment. What's your favorite sound? <laughs> Just small questions getting it difficult. <laughs> favorite sound? The sound I like very much is the ring of a bell in a, a criterium race when you're coming into the last lap. And what's your least favorite sound? Uh, my mobile phone in the morning. <laughs> what's your favorite food? Uh, pasta. And least favorite? Uh, how do you call this in German? Sauerkraut. What's your favorite curse? Uh, I don't have one. 